Hey guys, what's up? Fixtronic here again, and we are back with another episode of Off Peak. And I just realized there's an area that I haven't seen yet in this main hallway. Uh, it says sheet music over here, and there's some people here. So let's go ahead and see what they're doing. Hey, Boju, how much for the book? Uh, the price right here in the corner of the front page. Uh, what? How much? That's higher than the price. They go so fast. So you're a singer? Uh, wife has been singing for about a year now. My in-laws are coming over this weekend. I was hoping my wife could uh, make an enjoyable weekend indeed. Very good. I'll ring you up then. Okay, so he's buying it for his wife. I'll throw in the proper high school studies book as well. Is there a cell uh, cellist in your family? Well, I'm thinking of taking up the instrument, actually. Really? Cello? I know what you're thinking. What is he thinking? <laughs> the cost of strings, bow hair, rosin. I've read the price guides. I'm aware of the risks involved. Risks? <laughs> I watched those old videos of a stalker and what? If you say so, Lewis. I totally miss what he said. We're gonna have to go back around, but okay, Gusulado book. What? <laughs> I still can't read it. It's still too fast. Uh, see, so yeah, I have to do. Okay, so this guy's buying the book because his wife sings, and I was hoping my wife could teach them the piece. Oh, so like to teach the in-laws music. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, and and then he wants to pay a uh, cello, and the guy is like not sure, and then he thinks it's because it costs so much and there's like risks involved with playing cello. I don't know what type of instrument causes you risks that are like that risky. I mean, it's just an instrument, so I don't know. He's like, I just get the feeling I need to do this. Why does he want to play cello? <laughs> Interesting. Okay, so he won't say anything to me and he says about the same type of stuff. Ooh, I could take books too. Hello there. Oh, are you talking to me? Oh, he is. It's the same old story, I'm afraid. Musicians selling their prized sheet music on consignment. Easy money for them, the way the market is going. Yeah. Most of the players have had to mo more. What? Memorized? <laughs> Can't read. Memorize all this by now anyway. The saxophone pieces are from the same guy whose vinyl collection found its way to Shani over there. And the cello player? Not really sure about her. Oh, so somebody plays cello. Honestly, I can't complain about my work here. Seriously, sheet music practically sells itself. The business just keeps getting bigger and enthusiasts keep digging deeper into musical history. I've had several high school choral um, conductors request Spem in el Alium. Perot Lunaire flies off the shelves. What treasures these musicians have left for us. Interesting. The original owners of these manu manuscripts trust me to handle the business side of things. The consignment deals I have with them are quite fair. Although unlike other types of people I deal with, the owners don't have any intermediaries. Such trusting people. While I myself can't read music, I always know what these commuters really want and what they're willing to pay for. Interesting. Okay. And then it goes around again. Can I take one? Don't hurt me. <laughs> You're welcome to leaf through my wares, but you still need to pay for it before you board your train. Really? Do I? Can't I just like get on my train and like take off? Uh, yeah, I'm just leafing through some Bach. Uh, high school of cello playing. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm just looking. Remember, this isn't a library. Well, is it that? <laughs> so, okay, he's talking with the guy. I'm just gonna. Mm, I am a very curious person. I want to read everything. So, 
see. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. This. You really want a lot of music, don't you? Yes, I love music. And honestly, I do. I love music. It's so good. Let's see. Um. And again, like I said, don't steal in real life. But this game. <laughs> You really want a lot of music, don't you? Uh huh. Yeah, I just said I did. Uh, let me get that from you there, buddy. Oh, look, this one's in glass. I can't open it. Alright, let's take this one, a piece from here, and let's see what's to say. Cano canonic sonatas. Alright. Yeah, okay, concerto. Urban. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> Some of these are like in French and stuff. I don't know. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Yes, I. Achievement Unlock Sheet Music Librarian. Oh, yeah. That's me. Taking all the sheet music to play on my air instrument. <laughs> my air oboe. <laughs> or whatever. Wow, that's a lot of music you got there. Yes, I, I love it so much. It's so good. Can I take the one that he's pointing at, please? Yeah, yeah. Let me take it. Let me take it. Okay, fine, sir. You may have it today. But not tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, Marcus is up here. Should we talk to Marcus first, or should we go look at the other areas? I have a feeling I want to talk to Marcus, so... Let's go see what he is up to. See, there's music change. Yep, yep. Security guard. Okay. Uh, hi. Hi there, buddy. I'm not doing anything illegal. I'm just look around the station. Yep, yep. Oh, oh, oh. He's. What? What? Looking at me? <laughs> okay. Oh, these cows are moving. They're real. <laughs> What? Why is there cows here? This place used to be a pit of sadness before I showed up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Marcus. But through my tireless work, okay, I gotta read it better like this. Okay, there we go. But through my tireless work, we just ranked number two most enjoyable transit hub in the region according to Traveler's Quarterly. Ooh, fancy. And number one, unimportant to me. Well, that's the attitude. Don't compare yourself to other people. It's just do your best, right? Okay, I get uh, solicitations from business all over the city, begging to have a piece of real estate here. These businesses try to dazzle me with sales charts, press clippings, and bribes. But I just laugh in their face. They don't get that I'm a curator. I deem each business worthy of the needs and tastes of my customers. Not all of these businesses will do equally well, but I do not care. The tastes and whims of my customers are what's important to me. Yeah, just forget about the rest, right? <laughs> my ticket lady, Beatrice, she's a good friend of mine. She's probably the best at what she does in this whole city actually. In every customer satisfaction survey I've ever given, she gets top marks. Considering the needs of my customers are very specific and demanding. Keep all this in mind when dealing with my dear friend Beatrice. Luke has you running around as usual. Whatever ticket he's making you piece together, I gave that to him for a reason. But he's such a good lap steel player. I'm actually glad he's not leaving after all. But you. What? <laughs> Why do you always go to Railway Town anyway? Is it to visit relatives? To see old friends? Do they appreciate the sacrifice you make to get there? It's probably not my business to ask this stuff, but you travel through my station. You interact with my people, my business, which in turn becomes your business. 
Luke won't be around forever, you know. You'll have to pay your own way then. Or get a one-way ticket. This place used to be a pit, and I already said this before, so I'm just gonna stop talking now. You've heard enough. Be gone with you, peasant. Yeah, okay, Marcus, we get it. You're the boss of everything. Alright, let's go. Um. Alright, I think I'm ready to see what's underground. I just totally looked into the light and not the camera. I'm <laughs> blind as a bat now. Okay, where are we? Uh, yeah, this way. Um. Okay, so from what it seems like, apparently I'm not very welcome here. Probably because I ate all their pizza and took all their records and took all their music. Maybe. Just maybe, that's why. Uh, let's see. Um, okay, so four, five, banana, a skull, so maybe like a dead end track. And then, okay, so we're back. Uh, yeah, my camera decided to die right as we're like heading into this place. So, let's try this again, shall we? We'll just head down here. I only saw up to this point. Okay, so I I didn't go any further. I just like I tailed it back out of here. All right. Uh, okay, who are you? Are you selling me stuff under the table? Well, I mean, obviously it's on top of the table, but you know what I mean. He's like, shh, if you listen closely, you can hear the size of old trains long abandoned. They make these long, slow, deep tones. All day. All day, every day. Take any cookie you want. Oh, I can have a cookie? They're all pretty stale. Aw. Don't ask me what's in them. I don't know get what you pay for. I'm not paying for anything, so it's very true. I do miss the sun. How would you like it if you never got to see the sun? That'd be pretty bad, I guess. You need the vitamins. I know people think I'm a crone, but try spending your whole day underground. Well, yeah. Every morning, I arrive here on my little rowboat. Oh, you're the one that owns the boat outside. The sun is just coming up, hitting the buildings a certain way. That's the only time I get to see it. I want to take that moment and bake it into a cookie. Aw, oh, that's so nice. Nothing brings me more joy than reminding these hardworking fools in these times, they more than anyone deserve the simple pleasure. Or pleasures. I couldn't see if there was something at the end of that. Uh, I don't un... was it? Uh, why can't I read? Maybe because I blinded myself with the light earlier. Uh, I don't understand any of that music that Giant plays on his big piano. I don't care about fancy beer or personality pizza or tricky card games. Cookies and trains for me. Interesting. <laughs> it goes around. Okay, I will eat a cookie. Can I? <gasps> you put a little something extra in this cookie, didn't you? I'm so glad someone's enjoying my cookies. <laughs> Should I eat them all? <laughs> it was a little weird. A little weird. Am I gonna die if I eat them all? I don't wanna have to start all over again, but there are still four hidden achievements in this game, so I don't know. I could always check and see. <sighs> Let's eat some more cookies. Whoa. So glad someone's enjoying this cookie. Yeah, they're pretty good. Whoa, yeah. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> For a second, I was like, whoa, the base cut out. Like, what's going on? Can I, can I actually eat all these cookies? Uh, whoa. Whoa. Don't feel so well. <laughs> they're a bit much. That's all I could use. 
They're really good. <gasps> like nom 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 nom. Put all the cookies in my mouth. Just yum yum yum. Mm -hmm. Like Chips Ahoy, but better. Woo! The cookie crumbles. Yeah, I ate all those cookies. They were free, okay? Yeah, they, they might have tasted bad. They might have had a little something inside of there. I don't know. It's a little loopy. But, hey, we survived. So that means it couldn't have been all bad, right? No, it's bad. It's bad. I'm gonna go spit these out over here. Blah. <laughs> all right. So, there, there's no cookie, lady. I can't take any cookie I want. Take any cook. Oh, does she not mean those cookies? She made a different cookie. Never mind. Okay, let's see. Let's keep going. All right. So, let's see. Uh, it's that same service notice, like in the beginning of the whole area. Um, let's see. Okay. Okay, that cat is angry, and it's also a nun. Apparently, interesting. Oh, there's that low humming sound that she was talking about. The abandoned trains. Can I go down there? I don't know. Should I? These songs are weird. I mean, some of them are really good, and then some are just strange. Like, this one's pretty strange. I don't want to get run over by a train, though. Honestly, I don't know if you can die in this game. So far, it, that hasn't been the case, and nothing's really happened. I cannot see anything. It's pitch black. Maybe you guys can see something. Mm, but I really can't. I probably hit an invisible wall again. Probably. Oh, I'm down here. Okay, there's nothing really down here. Alright. Nope. Okay, I guess I'll go back this way. Interesting. Well, how else would I... <gasps> oh! I didn't expect to jump down, but okay. Can I go through this train like the other one? No. This one's actually fully rendered. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, I have to keep an eye on my time, because, like, the whole camera issue, like, threw me off on my time, so... I have to make sure that it doesn't cut out again, and... Yeah. What is back here? It's like a secret area. Okay. Ooh. Hey, it's like a little hideout. Interesting. Okay. Is that a record? Can I take it? I can't pick it. Hmm. Looks like something I would pick up, right? Ooh, look, there's another piece. It's another record. I can't take this one? Can I pick up anything? It's so annoying. Oh, wow. Is this thing to Jody Carver? A good friend and a good steel guitarist. Anthony. I can't read that. Hmm. Interesting. Modern guitar. You know what? Maybe I should pick up this piece at least, so I don't have to come all the way back down, grab a ticket piece. Yeah. Okay. Not bad. I can't get this mask thing with this. Okay, it's all electric guitar. It's pretty cool. But I can't pick up this record. At least I think it's a record, unless it's like a really fancy elaborate sticker or something. <laughs> uh, recycling bin. Oh look, there's that uh, space area, um, kind of like uh, from the top of the other subway area. See, I knew it all connected. Is that that low hum thing again? Should I go into the darkness? See what's in there? I don't know. It's an interesting place. Maybe this is where she sets up her stuff. I don't know. Let's just jump down and look. Oh. It's an invisible wall again. Duh. Okay, well that was anticlimactic. Uh let's go over here though. 
because maybe there's something else. Oh, but I was already on this side of the subway. Watch, I'm gonna get hit like by a train out of nowhere. <laughs> nope, invisible wall. Okay, let's run back. Choo choo, we're train. Choo 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 choo. <laughs> or subway, rather, because it's underground. Alright, let's go to this weird alien place. Might as well. We're already here. Let's see what's in store for us. Alright, you know what? Let me just check my setting stuff real quick. Okay, I think we're so good. Alright, let's go. I don't know what's in here. It's like some space age stuff. Wait a minute. What? That totally just led me over here. Weird. We're back with the dancing dude. Let's go see how he's doing. He's still dancing. You keep going. You know what it reminds me of? There was this old show called It Takes a Thief. I believe that's what it was called. It Takes a Thief with Robert Wagner, I think. Anyway, that old show, there was this one episode that was so funny because it was so, the way that they did it, it was hilarious. But like, there was this dance called the African Boogaloo and they danced kind of like that. And they're just like, into it and stuff. It's so funny. Like, it was like a popular thing or something back then. And so, there was a scene where the main guy and like the girl and like some people at this fancy party were dancing like that. And so, yeah, this just reminds me of that. <laughs> it's so funny. But anyway, if you think about it, there's like all these different dances that are so crazy nowadays. It's like, yeah, okay, it's funny. It's a dance, but it's funny. Alright, so this is the other side of the alien area. So let's see where this leads. And let's see if it comes back around or what. I don't know. I would think... Why is it so, like, blippy? Oh, oh, oh. It sounds like... That sounds like the place where the... Oh! Push? I don't want to just break in. Okay, I tell you what. We'll go back up. We'll go in from the front and we'll look around, scope out the place, see what's there. And then we'll come back to this and see if it really is the same place. Because I'm thinking maybe it's the same area as the circus place. But maybe this is like so you can get behind a counter or something so you can get a ticket. I don't know. But I don't want to just like bust in if it's like I'm not supposed to be there yet. Kind of like with the pizza. Like I want to hear what they have to say first before I start messing with them. And then they like change their dialogue and everything. So let's just run up over there real quick and we shall see what's going on. Are you still mad at me? Mm. Alright, so on the way there, I'm just checking my uh, ticket real quick. And yeah, it's, I mean, obviously not fully pieced together. Oh yeah, there's still this hallway, which I don't know where that leads. I kind of want to go to this area first, because it seems more lively and fun. I want to, I want to check it out. Huh, interesting. So it's like a bar. I thought it was a circus. Uh, let's see. Upright Brewing presents. Let me drink in the sounds of these special herbs. <laughs> what? Okay. Talent for the arts. Square culture for each civilization with more culture than you. What? Does this make any sense? Okay, let's just go in here. Um, some of these art pieces are pretty neat. Hey, that reminds me of uh, BTS's uh, wings, like when they go in the doorways. Um, like 
at their Wings concert. They had the videos of that. Uh, anyway, let's keep going. I don't know why they keep sneaking into my videos. They're just like everywhere. Let's see, aren't if I yeah, it's true. I'm glad we ditched the circus for this. They asked us to leave. I can't believe you wanted to be a part of it. It could have been great. All those tech rehearsals. Well, now the circus is all everyone's talking about. It probably would have given our band a lot of exposure. The moment someone starts promising exposure, I'm out. I can't help feeling like we missed a great opportunity. Rematch? Serbs is going to throw us out. So what? Let's just go for it. Ready for more punishment then? Always. This game. Mmm, I hate the circus. Dot, 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 dot. Seriously? I know, I got lucky pulling those agenda cards. But is my eye strong enough? Honestly, I don't think so. <sighs> so they're playing like cards. <laughs> I have 18 ice in my deck. It's really weak ice. Uh, ice and his medium strength will slow me down. Aren't defending your central. S what? <laughs> yeah, it's true. And the dialogue goes again. Okay, so they're playing a card game. They're the giants, uh, apparently. No, this is your favorite games. The new 5th edition printing. Yeah, I think so. I wonder if the problems that were in the 3rd and 4th edition are still here. Problems? Yeah, printing problems, errors. What exactly are these errors? I'm not going to tell you. Okay, why not? Because that'll give her the advantage. Once you notice, you can't unsee them. Now I'm really curious. I really can't tell you. Does your roommate know you're here? I told her. I think I heard your phone go off eight times in the last hour, just making sure. Are we going to finish in time for you to catch the train? The train isn't leaving the station for a while. We have plenty of time. I've never been outside the city. Towns like railway towns seem strange to me. I should have you out there sometime. We could get soft serve at Stu Leonard's. You'd love it. I don't really eat processed, processed foods and I'm busy for the next three weekends with school and stuff. Yeah, I know. School can be pretty hard. Hmm, okay. Isn't it your move? Hey, how did you let seven black dice take over the... what? I need a beer. Okay. I guess whatever game they're playing. I know this is your favorite game. Oh, it started over again. Okay, interesting. Hmm. Alright, let's see. One more conversation? No? Maybe? Can I play you? No? Okay, she's just staring at her cards. Oh, there's another ticket. Let's see. Uh, before we get into that... Mm, okay, maybe I can read this real quick. Okay. So I don't know what I'm doing, and then you crush us all. I really think I'm doing badly here. You're doing better than me for sure. I'm totally lost. <laughs> all you need to do is paste your worker spin the what? <laughs> the beauty of this game on the gear and planning ahead. I feel like I'm doing my tasks. Uh, Roland, you just dropped a corn token. It landed by your foot. Ooh, can I get it? I don't see it. <laughs> Guys, I have to leave in like 20 minutes. Can you finish without me? We still have time to catch the end of the circus if we hurried it up. The subway stopped running. We need to see this game through before it. Anyone want pizza? Stepping out to grab a few slices. I'm still thinking here. Pizza will help you think better, honey. The pizza here is really bad. Mmm, I ate a whole bunch of it. Are you kidding? Dennis worked at that place. Uh, he's like the next best thing. Here's a tip, just use those skull tokens on a small wheel. That'll help you. Can we just take a picture of the game and pick up next week? <laughs> I'm out of town next week. Me too, for the next two weeks. And I'm going to a wedding. Uh, guys, just this piece, technology, track, 
is going way too fast. I can't read. I don't really have time to do that. Henry, can you just make my move for me? Toppings requests. Mm. Typical Roland. I'm gonna say, I don't know what is there. Oh, okay, it went around again. Okay, I don't think I have enough time, but I'll make this quick. All right, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And if you wanna see more crazy random goodness, go ahead and click the links at the end, and I will see you all later, gamers. That was like the quickest outro I've ever done. <laughs>